Some people have never experienced what we actually do. They're making judgments without having any information. She's the unstoppable Connie Smudge, and this Saturday, she's going to do a drag queen story time for kids at the Coquitlam Library, featuring reading, crafts, and sing-alongs. And wash the spider out. But people are set to protest her event. People who Connie says have made threats, saying her presentation will sexualize or psychologically harm children. Sexualizing children is not what we're about. We're about to we're about creating an all-inclusive space where everyone can be themselves. Despite the hateful comments she says she's been receiving, Connie is still going to show up to the library, extending an open invite to all supporters who want to join her. We will. Um, all meet up at 9 a.m. at the waterfront station, and then we're leaving promptly at 9.15 a.m., and we're going to take the Sky Train out to Coquitlam Library, and we are going to create a bubble of love. The only way to combat hate is more love. Some of the people supporting Connie are familiar with the tactics that will be used, saying the protesters who will show up often record participants with their phones, egging them on for a response to loaded questions. A big part of us being at these events is just to intervene. So when passerbys do get caught up with this like rage bait, um, we can kind of say like, hey, like you don't have to answer these questions. We like to sing, um, especially with the kids around and everything. We try to lighten it up and make it feel like, you know, Festive. Coquitlam RCMP Corporal Alexa Hodgins says in a statement, police are aware of the event and will respond to any calls for service as necessary. Connie hopes the protesters will stop and listen. I always believe that it's hard to hate up close. So yes, you can read online, you can do all these things, but when you see who I am and you feel my energy and the energy of everyone there and what we're trying to create, that's what I want them to take away. Just look at us and see what we're doing. Don't make the preconceived notions and judgments of what they think we're doing. In Vancouver, Kier Junos, City News.